Very often, an otherwise great view to the outdoors is marred by the pickets or balusters supporting the handrail on your porch or deck. Your solution to a picket-free porch is MeshGuard, a revolutionary new screening system from ScreenTight. Designed for the infill area below the handrail, MeshGuard creates a clear, wide-open view, whether you're building a brand new porch or upgrading an existing one. With its rust-resistant hardware, galvanized steel reinforcement, and heavy-duty screen, MeshGuard is engineered to meet or exceed building code requirements. And by eliminating the need for balusters, you get a panoramic view from top to bottom. Balusters or pickets can loosen over time, so they no longer perform the safety feature for which they were designed. MeshGuard eliminates this problem and meets or exceeds the required pressure standards set by the International Code Council. It's also designed to integrate seamlessly with the original screen type port screening system above the rail, giving you the architectural freedom to create a clean, finished look on both new construction or converting an existing screen tight installation like this one. To begin, remove the screen tight cap around the entire section. Then pull out the spline and take the old screens completely off. Finally, remove the old base, and if you have existing balusters or pickets, these can be removed as well. To install your new mesh guard, start by measuring the length of the channels you'll need for the sides. The mesh guard framework comes in two sections, an outer base and an inner galvanized steel strip. The base is made out of a rigid PVC polymer, and it's easily shortened with a cutting tool. The galvanized steel helps to secure the base strip to the wood frame, and it can be cut with a jigsaw fitted with a metal cutting blade or by hand using a hacksaw. The steel strip must be placed inside the mesh guard base when installing. The steel must be anchored within two inches of the ends, so you may need to drill a hole in the metal strip in order to insert the screw. Once you have the vertical channels installed, Measure and cut for the horizontal ones. There's no need to miter the corners. Just attach the mesh guard base and steel strip to the porch frame with number six by one and a quarter inch screws. Once the framework has been installed all the way around, it's time to roll in your screen. You may need some assistance for this next step. Mesh guard uses a proprietary flat spline and a heavy duty polyester screen mesh. Orange indicators on both the spline and screen let your local building inspector know that all of the required components were correctly installed to meet building codes. You'll insert the spline orange side down by sandwiching the screen between the spline and opening and rolling it in with the screen tight roller knife. Start at the top left corner and continue all the way across, making sure to keep the screen stretched and even as you go. Now, roll in each of the sides. Take your time and make sure the screen remains straight all the way down. If you have to make adjustments, just pull out a section of spline, reposition, and roll it in again. The surface of the screen will tighten as the spline is rolled in. Now, finish off the bottom section. Once the screen has been properly installed and there are no sags or creases, trim off the excess screen with a utility knife. Screen type caps come in four colors and no painting is required. Simply position the cap over each channel, cut to fit, and tap it into place with a rubber mallet. If you're installing the original screen type system above the rail, the cap installs onto the base of both systems for a seamless finished appearance. Now you can enjoy a safe, unobstructed view without pickets or balusters, while keeping insects and unwanted pests out.